Uh, today, an iconic Portland business will open its first shop in Washington. Joe V is joining us from Vancouver at the newest location for Voodoo Donut. Good morning, Joe. <laughs> Good morning, guys. So, yes, it's their 10th location, their first one here in Washington State. Uh, the Vancouver Voodoo going to open only in about 15 minutes. And I'm joined by the three wise men of Voodoo. Of course, our buddies. This is Trace and Cat Daddy, the founders of Voodoo Donuts. And then a gentleman who's now, I believe, in his fourth year as CEO of Voodoo yeah. Donuts, Chris Schultz. Yeah. So, uh, first of all, Craig, uh, Trace and Cat Daddy, I want to start with you. You know, we, we've covered your story, obviously. You, you started your donut shop, kind of a little north in, in Old Town. This crazy idea. It took off. To the point where you now have a CEO yeah. and you're, you're, uh, you're opening shops all over uh, the country. Just tell us what you know today means and just kind of what you know the, what's happened to your crazy dream. You know, I can't believe it. It's all the way down here. We're opening our tenth location, and Trace and I rocked it out and built a great brand. But we brought on this wonderful guy, Chris Schultz, here to accelerate the brand and make us grow. And so we're just happy to a friendly cross the state line to Vancouver. We're really excited about this. And so, Chris, tell me a little bit. You know, Voodoo is such an interesting uh, property because yeah. it's there's a donut, but it's a vibe, man. I yeah. mean, it really it's is. It's a experience. vibe, and each location is different. So, how do you kind of keep that going as you open up these different shops yeah, all over a, the place? Yeah, it's important. You know, we bring a little bit of the Portland ethos over, but this is Voodoo Vancouver, right? The chandeliers are straight out of New Orleans, right? Sexy Sam Elliott is our is spirit chandelier. Yeah. So, we really wanted to make it feel like Vancouver Voodoo, not Portland Voodoo. So, all those folks that have gone over the bridge for years, we still want you over there with your friends and family and, and tourists coming to town, but now you got your local place to come hang out. And it's Voodoo, right? It's all about the experience when you come to Voodoo. And for me, it's worth the wait always. All right, Trace, uh, as you take a look around the spot, what are you thinking, man? Chandeliers in a voodoo. I just love it. It's, it's a beautiful store. It's, it's a spacious store, and I think that we're going to just do gangbusters here. And the people that we've employed here, it's just wonderful to just continue to continue the brand and continue to have people have a, an employment. And I want to say another cool thing. So voodoo now employs more than 300 people throughout the country. So what started with this shop in Old Town has really gone, you know, grown, given people careers. So very excited to see you guys. Congratulations uh, on your new spot. So uh, the ribbon cutting is in about 10 minutes. Y'all ready for this? Right. Y'all got right. your ribbon cutting shoes That's on? Right. Yeah. Exactly All right. Because let me show you, we got a line of people outside. There's a lot of excitement in Vancouver for their yeah. first Voodoo Donuts. They can't wait for the doors to open. And that'll happen in just about 10 minutes. We'll have more from Voodoo in our next half hour. Guys, back to you in the studio. Oh, I love to see so the excitement in the community yeah. for this as well. Oh, so fun.